Okay, so I'm back with some more Jersey Devil playthroughs. So we're gonna do Dumb Sweet Dumb now. Again, sorry for not being able to do audio for the first four parts in Museum Madness. I didn't realize that I couldn't record my voice. I didn't think about it until I realized I didn't have a mic. So I'm actually gonna have to play through the game without uh, commentary and then add my own commentary back in. Okay, so the where we started was kind of the main central place where you go through all the different levels to. And these sections, like right here, is kind of like a little hub that you can access two different levels in. And there's about uh, five or six hubs, maybe seven, I'm not sure. I haven't played this game in like over a year, so... So since we went through the museum, now we're going to access the little spinning dome, or the big spinning dome on top of the museum. First have to uh, stop it from spinning, obviously, and then you need to collect the new five NARF uh, tokens. NARF is the name of the, I guess, the main villain of this uh, game. I didn't get to show you guys the uh, opening movie. Um, basically, um, Dennis, which was the first boss you saw in Museum Madness, brought home a little Jersey Devil when he was a baby, uh, to Dr. Narf in his little laboratory, got a little, whole little cutscene of him going up the laboratory, and the explosion blew Jersey Devil as an infant all the way into the town of Jersey, or, I was never really sure if Jersey was... New Jersey, or a city in New Jersey, or Jersey is actually the name of the town. I can never figure that out. But anyways, he got blown up into, he got blown into Jersey. In years passed, and now he's this, and he's kind of become almost like a watcher over the town. Kind of like a superhero in a way. And he stops Dr. Narf, who's like, trying to take over the town, I guess? I'm not sure. And he's made these um, mutant vegetables as enemies against Jersey Devil. Got pumpkins and vegetables of all kinds. So if you notice, some of the boxes are in different places. Some stuff's been taken out since we first went to go to the Museum Magnet. Oh shit. Yeah, my health is still. Uh, down from the boss battle. It was a really close match. I barely got out of that one. I haven't gotten 100% on this game, but I've beaten it, like, last year. I had this game when I was a kid, and I could never beat it. Or, I never owned it, actually, but I rented it. And I never beat it in the time when I had it rented out. So I finally found this game, like, about a year ago on eBay for, like, a nickel. Got it, and I was able to beat it, finally. Of course, I had to start over, though, because my save file was corrupted. I haven't gotten 100% on it yet though, that's why I don't know where all the nitros are and where all the, the uh, hostages are. I'm gonna work on that as we go along. Anyway, the fifth token is right here, you gotta carefully glide to it. Cause if you miss that, you're gonna have to go all the way back up there. Kind of a bitch. But anyway, we got all five of them now. So we can go into the dome. 